Hey guys, as you can see on screen, it's Sniper Elite V2, which I'm guessing means Game 2. I got this game when it was free, like a year ago or whatever, for I don't know what event it was, but it was free. And I'm just gonna, I don't know, like, I haven't played it ever, so I want to like record it and see what it's like. Because that's smart, you know, play a game you never played before and record it. But, you know, if I don't like it, you'll never see this video. And if I do like it, you might see the video. And if I don't like it, but I feel like it's a good game... Nah, you won't see the video anyways. So apparently there's multiplayer, so I didn't know that. But we're just gonna go with the campaign. We're just gonna go with Marksman, because I've never played any of the Sniper Elite games, and I don't know. Machine, once unstoppable, was now on the retreat. The Allies in the West and Russia in the East were squeezing the tattered remnants of the Reich in a vice-like grip. Germany's last hope lay in their wonder weapons. The V-2 rocket, a huge leap forward in the history of military technology. It was a weapon system to herald a new form of warfare. Inhuman. Faster than the speed of sound, it struck without warning. The Nazis launched over 3,000 rockets in a desperate attempt to reverse history. It was a terror weapon. Pummeling Antwerp, Paris, and London. After the D-Day landings, their launch sites were overrun and pushed back out of range of England. But already, the Allies were looking to the future, to the next war. The Americans were gathering up the best of Germany's rocket scientists in the top secret operation Overcast. Many of the architects of the V-2 program had already been acquired, but not all. With Berlin encircled, Germany's last ditch defense falling back block by block, and total defeat only days away. Those scientists remaining in the city would soon be in Russian hands. My job was to make sure that didn't happen. Oh, so we're supposed to make it so the Russians don't overpower us with their awesome rockets. Or not awesome, but like we're we're just we're trying to make Major it so the General Russians. Hans okay. Von Eisenberg was negotiating in secret for safe passage for his team. Five of the V-2 program's top men. He was meeting his Russian handler at the Brandenburg Gate. This was my chance to take him out before he could seal the deal. I was prepared, focused, confident. Little did I know, it would turn out to be the most difficult mission I'd ever undertaken. All right, so we're just supposed to we're supposed to stop the Russians from getting information on how to make V-2 rockets because you know. No one wants war like that. B for binoculars. Okay. Alright. Survey the ruined building. Moves ahead. Use your binoculars. Look for troops. Looks like no one's there. WASD. Left ship. Whoops, I don't know why that just fucking gave me my steam overlay. Hold shift to run. That would be like what I would automatically assume for most games. Enter the ruined building, you what kiddo? How do that? What? Oh, okay. Alright, game, thank you. I feel, like this, I feel like this is gonna be like a realistic game where it's gonna have like bullet drop or whatever. How do I enter? Oh! See, I, I held spacebar before, but it didn't work or whatever. But I used to trip mine Z or X. Oh. Trip mine and F to use. That's a spring trap. That's a spring trap. Yeah, I don't. I don't want that. We want, we want a, yeah, we want a trip mine. Uh-oh. That's going to be bad. Reach the building up so without being detected, remain crouched to move silently. Your threat indicator will warn you of imminent danger. Danger, damn. Oh. Throw a rock to distract the enemies. 
wenigstens keine schlechten Nachrichten, oder? Keine Nachrichten. Hey, what's over there? Was war das? Yeah, what was what was that? What was that? What was that? That totally wasn't me. Yeah, that totally wasn't me. By adopting a prone stance, you'll be less visible for enemies and you'll have a steadier aim. Being prone allows you to crawl through confined spaces. Alright. So far I'm kinda liking the game. Like and it's just the intro and whatnot, but I always like games where there's like you can distract the enemies by throwing a rock or whatever. Like kinda like um uh, Far Cry three was like that. I think Far Cry Far like the yeah, just the Far Cry series in general. Take cover against an object in front of you. Use cover to remain unseen. Okay, Q to cover and A to move left. Your silence pistol can take out enemies without detect detecting them. Hit three for silence pistol. Mouse two to engage. Mouse one to shoot. Pa Shit. Use a landmine to booby trap the body. That's fucking evil. That's actually really evil. Can I, like, search the body? Did I fail? I probably failed. Yeah, I failed. It wasn't on the body. The body moves. Like, what do you want me to do? It, like, the body, like, moves, and I can't really... Use a landmine, blah, blah, blah. Okay. Now what? Do I drag the body? What do I do? Like, the body just, like, rolled away. And I don't really know what you want me to do, game. Game, what do you want me to do? Hold on, real quick. Just, uh... I'll probably cut this part out anyways. Just, uh, I need to see something. I need to see if V-Sync is on. No, it's not. Alright. I just want to make sure V-Sync wasn't on. What do you want me to do? Like, I don't... Like, fuck me. Use landmine to booby trap Labati. Okay. F to use inventory item. Okay, but what does that do? I booby trapped the fucking body. Do I like throw a rock or something? Like. Hey guys, come over here, there's a dead guy. Hey everybody, there's a dead guy over here, come find him. Oh! Rip. Alright, um, everyone just forget what, what just happened there. <laughs> oh. That was really bad. That was really, really bad. I feel really, really dumb. Oh boy, I am actually really, really dumb. My idiocy was showing right there. Like, fuck. Von Eisenberg was punctual and made no effort to hide his ugly face. <laughs> oh. Neither did his Russian contact. I had a clear shot. Pretty be it, comrade. pressure on the trigger, and it was a good night, Major General. Just Do a it. question of choosing my moment. 
Uh, right the now. The square was well sheltered, so there was no wind to worry about. I had to aim one notch above the target to compensate for bullet drop. I controlled my breathing to steady my aim. And then... Shoot. Alright, guys. We got this. We got this. Goodbye, Major General. Oh! Oh, right through his kidney! Oh, it's just gonna... Oh, into his arm! Oh, I got him! Oh, please tell me this is a good shot. Oh! Oh, yeah. oh grip. Damn, dude. Holy shit. Fuck him. Oh, he's dead. No, he's not. Now he's dead. Oh, you want to be a sniper? Shit. Shit. I don't know why it stopped crouching. Stop crouching. I got him, coach. Never mind. Got him, coach. Right through the, the the whatever that is area. Shit. Shit. Oh, the bullet drop. This is so hard. Please be a headshot. Oh, he's a, that's a that's a that's a kill shot. No way he was like living that. That's an in cap. Oh, I must have like broke his spine or something. I broke his spine. Oh, rip that guy. He doesn't have he doesn't have a working spine anymore. That guy's gonna be a cripple. Medic. Ah, now I wanted to put him down. Oh shit! What the fuck, dude? No, I Q, Q, ah Q. All right, all right. I I have. All right. I gotta. We gotta. Ah. Okay. All right, uh, escape the Germans. Man, being a sniper seems pretty fucking shit. Fuck. No, 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 no. Please don't kill me. I died. <laughs> that was actually really dumb of me. I shouldn't have just run out there like this was Call of Duty. Hey guys, I hope you liked that video. If you enjoyed it, don't forget to leave a like, rating, comment, favorite, and subscribe. And if it was really good, don't forget to favorite it. But that's only if it was really, really good. Don't forget if you want to follow me on Twitter, Instagram, or you know, maybe Twitch, because I stream there too, on Wednesdays. All those links are in the description down below. Don't forget to click the annotations on the screen. That'll take you to Foxy's channel, the showcase video at the top left, the playlist, or the mystery video. Also, don't forget to enjoy the sexy music 
that's playing right now. It's pretty good, isn't it? I like it. Yeah, so click one of the annotations on the screen. Go in the description and click the links. Leave a like, favorite, comment, blah, blah, blah.